What's going on, everybody? Back at it again with another stream video, whatever you want to call it. This is Trains the New Error. Played it before. Uh, this is, I think, this is a territorial. So we gotta get this locomotive moving. My controller was working with it, but <clears throat> just gives me opportunity to start using um, the keyboard. So what our other instruction is. I guess that's it.
decide to keep uh, keep the resolution the way it is. For some reason, sometimes I don't even think I can change it on here. This is supposed to be the realistic way of uh, playing it with this uh, control panel right here. Santa, this vocal. I used to play trains uh, 20s, uh, 2006. Um, that's when I had it playing on a laptop. It was nice. It's interesting. And, um, I played that game a lot. I mean, I even did the uh, maps. I wish I could have recorded all that stuff, but I did. I didn't know about streaming. I know about streaming. And I probably could have been streaming a lot of that stuff I did. I just all in my memory bank <laughs> just a memory <laughs> that's another reason why when I, re when I play I stream you know why I record it because those memories you can't take them back you know and I spent a lot of money with, for the little content and stuff like that. Yeah. Then they had like bits and keys. I'm surprised they didn't um just not on here. I might have to look through it and see. But you can see they actually got a game like it, but this is as close as you can get to it. like riding a bike because I haven't really played games like this in a well similar to this. I mean um, Train Sim World is, is more uh, is more up to date than this but the thing about it is 
pretty much the same. All of them are the same at the wall. So the inside. up a little bit Back memories. Just I don't have the money for to be buying all this, all these uh, DLCs, man. They just, you might as well just give it away. I mean, nobody's really buying this stuff unless they really into. I mean, I'm into it, but it's just I refuse to spend all the money on you know, for DLC for you know like that. And this is supposed to be this is yeah this is the actually the update of the game I used to play all the time on my computer and it was on a disc. You know, that was before I actually learned about Steam and whatnot. I didn't know Steam actually existed. I was already gaming, I was already in the computer. Uh, because I had ATs wheels of steel hauling and, and uh Euro Truck Simulator and uh spin tires and Farming Sim 15, some things. And I got a lot of games, a lot of games, a lot of computer games that I don't even play no more. It just, just taking up space. I used to get them from the um, half price books. They used to have, well, they have a half price books around <coughs> certain areas in town, and um, that's where I, how I used to get my computer games. I'm sort of driving slower than normal. I should be driving faster than this. Well, they talk about the limit is 60 miles an hour. I can bring it up a little bit, but I want to give myself room to break and stuff like this. Like I said, I wanted to get into more of these my games that I don't get into anymore. You know, even if I, you know, just play a little of it, little of that, little of this. So, Yeah, but I never played in this mode. I always played in the throttle mode where you had to use the mouse. And uh, I used to play the mess out of that game. Just, just sad that all that content that I have is gone. Just, it doesn't exist. So I didn't think to record it. I just played the game. <laughs> you know, that's all. I just played the game. Laptop used to put out some pretty decent graphics. I still have it. It just don't work anymore. I don't know what went wrong with it. Could never get turned back on. You know, 
I spent a lot of money on that laptop too. And that's when I really started learning about uh, gaming computers and stuff like that. And, uh, will I buy another gaming um, laptop? I don't know. I ain't gonna say what I ain't gonna do and what I am gonna do, but yeah. that thing had 750 gig hard drive at the time. I had a lot of games on it, a lot of content on it. <clears throat> I still got the hard drive. Um, I think I might have took the hard drive out and forgot to put the hard drive back in. I don't know, or I just upgraded it. I think I upgraded it. Kept the, uh, the older um, older hard drive. I wasn't really savvy about using the keyboard. I think I'm gonna get me a mechanical keyboard. I hear they're nice. Nice to have. Sort of heavy. I was, we was moving a little bit. There we go. Yeah, uh, trains, trains classics, trains. Uh, I know trains 06, trains classics. I had to hold the whole, um, it was like a pack. And I think I paid little or nothing for it. Still got that game somewhere. That's around here, but I never really got into it because it took up too much space on my hard drives. Um, but um, it's okay. Mm. Still nice to be to go back and um, back and through the archives. And, And you could get the content. See now, see they had trains that looked like this that they had you buying. Now the ones that I actually had, um, because I had paid for the for the key, I was able to download a lot of this stuff off offline. And, um, and that was back in back in the day when DSL when DSL was was out. <laughs> They had some trains that didn't even have the exhaust. I mean, they had the exhaust coming out of them, but they didn't have the fans going, the animation. Now this one actually has the animation. I'm gonna show y'all. Joint rail was what we used to, uh, we used to be under. So let me see where it's settings. This is joint rail right here. They started putting the joint rail, um, some of the trains in here from joint joint rail. Um, I used to get uh, high um, used to get high rail uh, trucks, but they were you, they you couldn't drive them. There was some that you could drive, and then there was some that you couldn't drive. And I had them hooked up to the train. It was so funny. And then quiet as cup. I was just actually playing with the game and didn't know that the trains were strong enough. To, uh, I mean, the trucks were strong enough to pull a train, you know. You know if you look into, uh, I've had come across a couple videos on YouTube where they had some Western Star truck stacks, they were high rails, and it was interesting how that thing was able to pull, uh, pull a truck, I mean, pull uh, tr train cars. Because a lot of times they would use it, they would be doing track maintenance, and then you need those vehicles to get on the track, to get on the tracks, and do their job. You know, do the track maintenance and stuff like that. So it was nice. All right. already 
sort of driving slow. They don't know that our speed is already low, but I'm just sort of feeling my way through. It's, it's been a, well, technically I didn't really like this, these controls. I like to use the mouse. I didn't really. I knew the what controls to use and things of that nature. We're going to bring our momentum up now. Stop playing games now. Some reason my webcam went out, so I have to get back online. I think I got too many things plugged up for the. Uh, I don't know if it's because of the board. Sometimes it's, the Windows is just acting silly. Sometimes. So. I need to get back into my train stuff. It was fun. Hooking up to stuff and, and watching the animation of picking up coal and, and uh, picking up uh, various other stuff that you can pick up. And then you can actually dispatch the uh, trains, other trains that do certain things. It was nice. You had AIs in, involved. I'm surprised it ain't, they didn't put it on Steam. But probably because of call it a new era. Era. Um, I think that was the the whole point. And there was another game. There was another train, but train the train driver or something like that. I liked it that because you actually got a chance to power up certain stuff. Power up. Um, you would drop drop off certain stuff at certain um, destinations and and. Um, it was fun. It was fun. Yeah, we sort of keeping our momentum down. Okay, I guess this is that. This may be the tunnel right here. Going too fast or too slow anyway. <laughs> I'm just silking it a little bit. This is our limit, 40. Don't 
hold right there, hold tight right there. Up a little higher. We already at our limit. Well, before you be lower our limit, so. I think I will be playing this game more often if they would. They might as well just drop the price on all that stuff. I mean, it's just too too pricey. And even uh, Train Sim World has gotten kind of crazy with their prices. You know, I understand you got to pay for whatever. You know, and you use that to sort of help get other people involved with the game, so you can keep cut, keep the costs cut. You know, if you don't get nobody buying your game, then you're out of business. So you got to go and find people to go and get into it. We're going to go on ahead and let this initial. Did y'all see that from the side? I didn't even know what I was hitting at. to let the momentum keep up like the train is pretty much holding itself Court for my uh, mic. I was a fan of uh, Conrail and CSX. That's all I used to have. Tra Conrail trains and CSX trains. <laughs> and then uh, Southern Pacific were a couple of my trains I used to have. I used to have so many trains. I wish I had on that game. I just wish I was able to uh, reflect back to it. I know I could probably find content on it. Somebody can probably, you know, and it was streaming or whatever but I didn't know about streaming and I probably didn't have enough power to stream anyway because of DSL and you know dial up
picking that momentum up. Oh, we trying. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna try to play Train Sim World on my um, on the keyboard. Just you know, a lot of gamers play on play on the keyboard. I think I'm gonna go on ahead and buy me a um, might might go tomorrow. Go to Micro Center and see if I can find me uh, another keyboard. But um. Uh, gaming keyboard cheap one that'd be nice I drive my truck to see um, nice little truck just trying to enjoy everything you know and before everything's back to normal order some parts from my other vehicle so I can get that together <laughs> Okay, let's see. Okay, we want to. There's momentum up. I know we're getting ready to stop, so I'm trying to pay attention. You're about to pass a yellow signal, uh, which means the signal beyond is currently red, and you must prepare to stop, close the throttle, and this time tap A twice uh, for more forceful brake application so we only let's see where we at Start hitting these breakers now. Slow it down a little bit. That's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pay attention to this signal. The initial, initial. Oh, wait, hold on a minute, y'all. I got something, I think. Catch y'all on the next video. I'll catch y'all next time.